an authority. Man, come, come on, that on. is for somebody. Come on, bridge. Come you on. Know, because even a true prophet of God will be inaccurate sometimes because we're human. And so mm. accuracy is not the barometer of whether or not you're you're in or out of the kingdom. All of us see in part. All of us say and do things. Accuracy is not necessarily always the litmus test. And I think some of you guys, this this is one of those teachings, and this is why you got to keep sharing it, is because this is one of those teachings that are graduating you in levels yes. to be like, wow, the, the immature version of me was wild because someone was accurate. Now wow. I'm sometimes because we're human and so mm. accuracy is not the barometer of whether or not you're you're in or out of the kingdom all of us see in part all of us say and do things accuracy is not necessarily always the litmus test and i think some of you guys this this is one of those teachings and this is why you got to keep sharing it is because aren't learning how to discern authority man come, come on, on that is for somebody on, bridge. Come you on. know because even a true prophet of God will be inaccurate sometimes because we're human. And so mm. accuracy is not the barometer of whether or not you're you're in or out of the kingdom. All of us see in part. All of us say and do things. Accuracy is not necessarily always the litmus test. And I think some of you guys, this this is one of those how accurate they are. Stop being impressed by accuracy and start learning how to discern authority. Man, come, come on, on, that is for somebody. Come bridge. Come you on. Know, because even a true prophet of God will be inaccurate sometimes because we're human. Oh, really? Well, what does the Word of God have to say about that? We know that the Word of God says that when a prophet prophesies falsely, they are to be put to death. Now, you should be thankful you're not under the Old Testament law anymore. But I would like some New Testament scripture telling me where it says that even a even a true prophet will be inaccurate sometimes. Because if a true prophet is speaking the words of the Lord, supposedly, well, the word the, the Lord is never inaccurate. So, this whole prophetic movement nonsense that they got going on today, friends, be very leery of it. Be very, very leery of it. They teach you that you can be taught how to be a prophet. You can go to the school of prophets and learn how to prophesy and, and, and make false prophecies. It's okay. Mile, turn There's right nothing wrong. Road. There's nothing wrong with making false prophecies. Get the heck out of here. You guys are a bunch of devils and a bunch of liars and deceivers. And we're going to continue exposing this video too because these guys, these cowards, refuse to expose Passion Java and Lovey Elias because they're a respecter of persons, because Daniel Adams is yoked up with Lovey, because Greg Locke is yoked up with Lovey. We'll get more on that later, though, guys. God bless.